Hey everybody, it's Sarge, and welcome to episode number 19 of the Mercenary Tank Tech Tree Showcase. Today, we're looking at the Tier 7 Medium Tank, the Big Top. The skills that we have on our commander are Sixth Sense, Situational Awareness, Camouflage Expertise, Born Leader, Rapid Loading, Steady Aim, Run and Gun, Snapshot, and Rapid Aim. The equipment that we put on this tank is for our medium tank setup. Advanced optics, advanced loader, advanced concealment, enhanced targeting information. We've taken this tank into battle 90 times. We've had a below average 45% win rate, a 22% survival rate, and a 73% mark of excellence. I don't even know where to start to talk about the armor on this tank. You have so many mixed matched pieces hanging all over this thing. You have 10 millimeters of steel on the left side of the turret acting as spaced armor, and you have a bunch of pieces of steel up and down the left and right sides, right above the tracks, acting as 12 millimeters of armor. The thickest part of the armor on this entire tank is the front face of the turret. Around the gun you have 101 millimeters. Behind the gun you have 114 millimeters and that front rounded lower plate is 109 millimeters. So don't be afraid to go haul down with this tank. It's got the hull of a Sherman, the turret of a Pershing, and a list of qualities that makes it an excellent support tank. When fights begin to go south, Big Top can respond with vigor, haste, and strength, benefiting the entire cavalry troop. Cavalry relies on range and mobility, attack from a distance, and redeploy when and where needed, but avoid close combat brawls. All right, Malinovka. I think we're going to do a hard left, go up the 1-2 line, see what we can spot, see what we can shoot out in the field. There's a three-man platoon on the enemy team, three mediums. Uh, this tank's not too bad. You can go 50 kilometers an hour in it. Has a 90 millimeter gun. Reload time starting out, it's about nine and a half seconds, which is pretty slow. I think we got ours down in the seven second range. It's got a very nice negative 10 degrees of gun depression. The alpha ammo pen will do 160 millimeters of enemy armor. The premium APCR will pen 243. So there's no reason not to run the APCR. That's what we're gonna run hot and heavy today. We're gonna hit the enemy for about 240 hit points on average if we pen them. The shell velocity for the premium ammo is 1,066 meters a second, which is beautiful. Good hit into their T-37. We got a shot into them and a little spotting assist. Accuracy is okay at 0.38, and the aim time's a little slow at 2.3 seconds. We got our first KO. All right, let's see, let's see. There's another one. M4A3 E8. Can we get a shot into him? No, we missed. We didn't let that two and a half second aim time get all the way aimed in. Little slow, little derpy. Can we get a shot here? Can we lead a shot? Get a shot? No. Oh. What's that light tank doing? Can we get a shot into the light tank? Oh, looking good. Yes. <laughs> Woo wee. We got a VK out in the open. Let's track them and get some damage. Let's aim right there in the final drive, right at the front drive wheel of the track. Can we get another hit? We can. We got them tracked. So we're going to get some more assist. Oh, somebody else got the KO, but we got the assist. I'll take it. We got an M6. We got a VK piled up in a traffic jam out in the middle of the field. We're spotting them. We're getting some good assists. Let's just throw a shot out there. See who we hit. We hit somebody for 235. I think it was the VK. A VK's gone. Can we get the M6 off the board? Got him. Got him. All right, let's push up. I was going to go all the way to the one line and go up the frozen pond and come around the hills, but we got two light tanks and a medium tank out front pushing hard, so let's follow them. Let's stay back about one, one and a half grid squares from them. That way we're outside the render range of anybody they come across, but we should still be able to get some shots in. We should still be able to shoot some red tanks. Ten to nine, we're leading, but we got that three-man team on the other side. 
That's kind of unbalanced. They've got three players in communication with each other, coordinating attack and movement, so we got nothing. We got some shots into a VK3601. A lot of VKs on the battlefield today. We hit him for 239. A little bit of a low roll, looking for, two for 240 or higher. That's right. 240. Got him again, 214. A lot of bit of a low roll on that one. Looks like we got some green team members capping. Nine to eight, still a lot left to do in this battle. It's feeling pretty good. I hope we don't cap out. I hope somebody resets the base. We got three guys on the base. I think it's going to get reset. They're out in the open, and we got five tanks in our face right here. Good shot for 261 in the OI. We're bouncing some shots, so I'm not going to move. I'm going to try and sit still, get the shots in. Somebody's locked into us. The OI bounces. I like that. I like that. OI is gone. We got another OI. Let's put some shots into the track, get some damage, and some track assist, I hope. During that seven second reload, if you can track somebody with your shot and get damage, you're going to get that assist during that reload time. So we're going to try and push it. Get another shot into him. Oh, we got hit by the tank destroyer and we bounced off the VK or OI. TD up there on the right hand side. We got to be careful. Can we get another shot into the OI? We can. Can we KO him? Only 216 hit points. We just get a low roll on him and we got a KO. Here we go. Oh, you got to be kidding me. We hit him for 215. We left him with one hit point. Come on, RNG. Come on. And somebody else gets the KO. What is this? We got a Kraft macaroni and cheese tank coming at us. That's one of the platoon. That's one of the three cats in the platoon. So their coordinating efforts are going to come at us. We got to be careful. Six to four. We're up in the count. But like I said, they got a three-man platoon talking on headsets about what they're doing, where they're going, and why they're doing it. That's kind of a misadvantage against us. But let's keep fighting them. Good pen. 237. We're going to have to hit him about three more times. We bounced a shot off him. I don't want to trade one for one. We bounced two shots off of him and penned him once. So he's getting in two shots for every one reload we're getting. We got to be careful. We got to get him. Oh, he penned us. We hit him for 245. We got him down to one shotable, I think. We need a little bit of help here. A little bit of help. Not sure who's locked on to us. Let's go around to the little hill here, the, the spotting hill that everybody goes up. Okay. I need help. We have a tank destroyer going up the hill, so that's good. He's going to go up there and spot. Hopefully, he can get some good use. It's looking pretty good for the green team, but there are no guarantees. We outnumber him two to one. Now, I'm thinking we got that craft on the left. Anybody right here? There should be somebody right here. There's the craft. He's a one shot. Even if we low roll, maybe. Okay, there's a VK up on the hill. Can we get a shot into him? Snap it. We did hit him for 230. Beautiful. Beautiful. Every shot counts. You never know what's going to happen at the end of a battle. You never know. We need to go after that craft. We need to get him off the board. I got a feeling that heavy tank that's trying to cap is getting ready to get blown up. There he is. There's the other. What is it? I think they got another craft. Two crafts and a VK on the platoon. Yep. Yeah. Oh, he's gone. Doggone it. We need to get a shot into this craft. Oh, beautiful side shot. Can we get it? Yes. Yes. Nice. Look at that. Good battle. Good battle. 5,343 damage. Woo-wee. Not bad for a tier 7 battle. And it looks like we got about 1,100 assist. 1,196 assist. So 5, 6. 6,500 combined so far. 4 to 2. They took out two of ours. We took out one of theirs. That's not enough trade. We need to get another one of theirs off the battlefield. If the VK is playing in a coordinated platoon very effectively, he should be coming down to push us. The tank destroyer that went to the hill is dead. The tank destroyer that was in the field is dead. It's just me and two heavy tanks that are hidden back in the back. They're sitting back. They're moving slowly, it looks like, so I don't know what they're doing. VK's coming at us. Craft's got us locked in. Man, that craft has some OP camo. I don't know how he's doing it. That's crazy. I'm thinking, you know what? Let's go back. Let's see if we can pull back into the field behind the heavy tanks. Let's get behind the heavy tanks and maybe get some sniping shots in. Let's use our camo to the same advantage that the enemy's using theirs. So we can just make it out here a little bit farther. We just got to get out of here. We're already outside the gun range at the top of the hill, so that helps. 
Let's keep going. Keep moving. Oh, no, 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 no. Somebody's got us targeted. It's the VK. And we got hit by the craft. Dang it. We're going to have to go back down, hold down to the hill. That shot just missed us. The heavy tank's trying to cap. Can we get a snap into the VK? We can't. I didn't see any red reticle outline there, so I knew that was probably going to miss. But you never know. You never hit the shots if you don't take them. That could have went a little high based off of RNG. Oh, it's tied 2-2. Two to two. It's me and the, the heavy tank capping versus a coordinated platoon. So, man, that flipped pretty quickly. Benefits going to the, the red team right now. Here comes VK. How far is he going to go? He looks like he's moving pretty fast on the minimap. we got to keep an eye on the craft. Here comes VK. I think he's going to push us. He's going to jump on a snapper shot into him, pal. Got him for 229, and he blows himself up. We're down to six hit. Uh, oh, man. That was a dominating battle. Look at that. Five kills, 55-72, 16-47 XP in a loss. Third place in a loss. Come on. 5,6700 combined. We blocked 510. What did we get? Let's see. Did we get a first class at least? Five kills. Oh, baby. <laughs> Woo-wee. Boom, 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 boom. We got an ace and a loss. Oh, man. There's nothing more we could have done there. We did everything we could possibly have done and got every shot we could have taken. Good battle. Good battle.